What is up, YouTube, man? We back again with another reaction. Shout out to my 39 subscribers. Hey, this hoe growing quick, bro. This hoe growing fast as hell. Shout out to y'all niggas, man. Appreciate y'all. But today we got Charleston White on rappers getting his IG deleted every time he goes off on them. Say Cheese TV, man. Without further ado, like, comment, and subscribe. Let's jump right into it, nigga. Gang, gang. <laughs> Oh man, we're back, man. We got the famous man, the 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 crazy, the the comedian, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. the 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 genius, the troll, the marketer, Charleston White. Oh, uh, in, in the in the rat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to put me in the rat category too. Now, don't forget about Rat Williams. Can't forget <laughs> about Rat Williams. Rat Williams, man. You know it's funny because when we post you on Say Cheese and I tag you, and, and man, your shit shot up. What you had like a hundred ten thousand followers now? Yeah. Yeah. I, I told you to change, don't put Charleston White because they was going to keep snatching it. Yeah. And then, yeah. and then somebody else said, hey, uh, start spending money with Instagram. So I've yep. been spending money with them. So they stopped. So they took me off their shadow ban list. Yep. That's how that works. Yeah. I started spending money with them. So they took me off their shadow ban list. That's how it works, man. Uh, I'm on mine too. I'm going to be good this time. Yeah. Because <laughs> I'm going to play I well with others. Cause I, I noticed you post a lot of your old Facebook posts on there. Yeah. And you know, use the <clears throat> N word a lot. Uh, use a lot of different, you know, foul language. And that's how, to me, I think that's why your shit used to get took. And I don't understand that shit, bro. Like nigga, we live in such a fucking sensitive ass world. You can't say nothing no more without getting canceled, bro. You can't have an opinion nowadays. You can't do shit. It ain't like 30 years ago when you can say whatever and get away with it. No, bro. Today, if you say if you say something even even remotely offensive, you getting canceled, bro. Your whole shit taken down. Instagram be one of them. TikTok, Twitter, YouTube. YouTube is the worst when it comes to that shit, bro. All these sensitive ass platforms. That's why I'm too real for these platforms, bro. I'm too fucking real, bro. This shit be lame as hell sometimes. Oh, uh, well, lie. every time I got into it with a celebrity, uh, Every time I got into it with a celebrity, they know people. We didn't. We don't know on this side of the camera that you have Facebook, you have Instagram, you have Twitter, then you have Metaverse, right? So all of these people, if they get mad at you, if if if, if a celebrity calls them and say, "Hey, let me pay you five thousand dollars to shut this account down," you get shut down like that. So mm -hmm. it wasn't until I got into it with T.I. and Boosie, when my account got shut down, I finally got introduced to the Metaverse people. So I actually got somebody's number from the Metaverse world who at first, they said, man, they got a lot of restrictions and hits on your account. He said, but I can take them Bet off. Bet they do. Once he went to looking at my account, he said, man, they got a lot on your account. So he said, man, it's gonna cost you anywhere from about $5,000 and I can get your account back. With that $5,000, I can get your account back and I can get it to where they never do it again. This is a guy that's working in Metaverse. Shout out so to that nigga. So when Elon Musk, when he bought Twitter and he started exposing information that they're selling blue checks, it's the same thing with Instagram. Absolutely. So, bro, Elon Musk needs to buy up YouTube. Elon Musk, please buy YouTube, bro. I swear to God, YouTube will become a better platform than it, than it has ever been. If Elon Musk would just buy that bitch, bro, buy YouTube, buy Instagram, buy every social media platform, bro. You got the money, my nigga. You can make this shit a whole lot better, bro. Please buy YouTube. Please buy YouTube. So this is why I fuck. This is why I don't like celebrities. This is why I don't like these niggas like these rappers. They are the new overseer, homie. Mm. So meaning they can oppress me. Because they're in a position to reach the metaverse to call somebody inside of Instagram. So that's what happened to Charleston White. When I make celebrities mad, they can crush me because they know somebody they can call on the inside. Thanks. Right? We don't know that, homie. So this is what I'm telling regular people. Your celebrities are the new slave masters. They are the new white boy with the whip saying, say, pick more cotton, nigga. So they the new slaves. They the new overseers, homie. Wait, so it makes what, sense when you what, think about it. Who do you it? think ratted you out? 
What celebrity got mad and, and went and snitched on you to get your shit done? Probably one of the uh, niggas well, been it, talking it about. It first started when DMX died. So I, 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 I pissed off a lot of people in the <clears> industry <throat> when I first started disrespecting Nipsey Hussle. So it started there. Uh, when I got into it with WAC 100 and Big U, they was over at Worldstar. Mm. It started there. Uh, uh, what was another celebrity I got into it with? Uh, it, it was I even obvious, remember the, it was I remember the Johnny, I the Johnny with Dang Boy. shit. The Who? Johnny Dang shit. You yeah, got, the, you got, yeah, the, the Johnny, Johnny Dang When shit. I got it with the Johnny Dang. So, yeah. uh, so the Asians run YouTube. Hell yeah, so they do. So then I met some people prior to seeing the, the, the 60 minute Dateline study, how you can buy views. I've been on the internet for four years, homie, going viral. I've never bought a view. I've never bought a like. Me either. I've never bought uh, a- Any nigga who buy uh, views, buys a fucking blue check, Buys uh subscribers, any buys followers, you a fucking pussy, nigga. You a bitch. That let me know right there that you don't work hard at all for anything, nigga. You just cheat and let that shit just come to you instead of just chasing after that bitch like a real nigga, bro. See me, I didn't buy these thirty nine subscribers. It was their own choice. I just put content out there that they fuck with and they have to subscribe. Now I tell people to subscribe, but I don't force them to subscribe. I just tell them, hey, like, comment, subscribe, all this shit. They just do it, bro, because they fuck with me. These are real life people. I hate niggas who buy shit like that, bro. Niggas be pussy for doing that shit. And, bro, hell yeah, Asians do run YouTube. They do, bro. Shout out to my Asian. Shout out to my Asian people out there. But Asians do run YouTube, bro. But there do be a, a lot of racism when it comes to YouTube, bro. That's why I think a black person needs to be higher up on YouTube, bro, so he can level out the playing field and get some of these black content creators up there on the scoreboard, bro, because that's a whole nother topic for another video, bro, but that whole black content creator shit and racism is just, that shit is just fucked up. Uh, followers or subscribers. I start realizing that they can buy followers, right? They can, they can buy followers, right? Anybody so can. when I realized that, I said, they can, they manipulating us, homie. So somebody like me who don't have the knowledge of the internet who gets on here, that's why it was so easy to shadow ban me. That's why it's so easy to delete my accounts. I, I've had over 10 Instagram accounts deleted in, in 24 months. Right, damn. I, I've lost, over, I, I've lost, and, and each one gets deleted at 100,000. So once I reach 100,000, they delete it. Uh, I've had three Instagram accounts deleted. I've had two demonetized. Mm. Uh, I've lost over eight Facebook pages in the last 24 months. Uh, so they, they just delete them. When I appeal, I never hear nothing back from on the appeal. I understand that this is my intellectual property <clears> that they're <throat> taking. So by law, by law, they're violating a lot of rights, but I, don't, I can't. Yeah. There's no lawyer that's going to take on these big texts. On top of that, you have people who are friendly, who, who are industry friendly, who work in these, in, in these social media platforms. They're industry mm -hmm. friendly. They're fans of these people. So they too can be bought and persuaded to silence you if you yep. speak the wrong political message. So, uh. And with that appeal shit, bro. Hold up. Uh, with that appeal shit, nigga, bro, like. When somebody appeals something on YouTube, nine times out of ten, they're not going to reply. If they don't reply in their business days, bro, just don't even, because they they are they already made up their mind, bro. They already made up their fucking mind. And YouTube do that shit a lot, bro. Especially for black content creators, bro. But that's a whole nother topic. That's why I don't follow no social media rules. I don't give a damn about losing a social media page. Mm. When I saw the movie Dolomite, uh, everything that I'm doing, Dolomite was doing and saying in the 70s, even from R.A.P.E., you know, the Caucasian women, even from that standpoint, he even he acted it out in movies. So I'm mimicking that same satire comedy. Right. So what I saw in the movie Dolomite, what he done in real life, he was at a show. They wouldn't let certain people in because the show was sold out for whatever reason. He went outside and performed on the streets, on the corner, and sold out the show on the corner. So I had to figure out a way 
to, because I see that they erase me. They, they delete me. They censor me. They silence me. Uh, so I had to figure out a way to the transcend your whole what image. I'm doing on the internet in, in real life and, and monetize it as well. Because uh, as, of, as of May 2020, I have now June of 2020, I haven't made one dollar from a social media platform. Mm, damn. Damn. So all my money's been coming in interviews or uh, shows or uh, uh, features on songs or uh, 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 a, a contract, uh, 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 an exclusive deal that I signed with the weed spot. So I get a nice uh, royalty check uh, uh, annually for that. Uh, I had to figure out a way to take my voice because TikTok won't pay me. Uh, yeah, TikTok, man, bro, these social media platforms be something else, bro. They really do, my nigga, like. Oh my God, like, like with the whole TikTok shit, cause these white TikTokers, right? They'll take a black content creator's dance, try and mimic it, and then they blow up from it. And then they leave the black, the original creator in the dirt. They don't even mention them. They don't even credit them, bro. And now these white motherfuckers, they getting fucking, uh, all these deals and all this shit, bro. When that should be her. The original content creator. The black content creator, dog. And then with YouTube, it's the same shit, bro. Twitter. They be playing the same motherfucking game, bro. The, the same game, dude. Like I said, these social media platforms, they have an agenda. They have a certain agenda that they're trying to push. And if you go against that agenda, you're done. You're canceled, kicked off. Psst. Instagram yeah. won't pay me. YouTube won't pay me. Facebook won't pay me. Google won't pay me. Uh, so I had to figure real. out a way. So since they won't pay me, I took those same voices, those same videos, and, and registered them with BMI and, and ASCAP. So I get a publishing check now. Too real, bro. You're too real, nigga. That's how it be. When you're too real for social media, they don't like your ass. They gonna cancel your ass real quick. Hey. <laughs> My nigga too real, bro. Too real for social media. But anyway, that's going to be in this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see y'all boys in the next one. Peace.